Shalom and welcome to Tumas of Torah. This year is entitled The New Decor in My Office. So many may have noticed that behind me, top of the Israeli flag, is a beautiful piece of Jewish artwork. I thank Dr. Levitan for it. And there's a very, very special message. It's a picture of the Migdash, the Third Temple. And above it is written, Literally, it means, it's part of Atzilu, we say thrice daily. May our eyes behold the Shuvcha Litzion Brahma when you Hashem return to Tzion with mercy. So, the simple meaning is Hashem, one day you're going to return. We're going to have a Messianic year, we're going to have a Mikdash back, we're going to have Korban up, we're going to have all the Sanhedrins up there. Three Sanhedrins in the Harabayat Mikdash area. 630 minutes are going to be back again. Hashem, we hope to be alive during that time. That is the simple meaning. But the other meaning, and Dr. Levantin knows how I love this other meaning, is it's from the Talmud of Rav Kook. Of course we want to be Hashem when you return. That's not the request. The request is, Let our eyes see when you return. When we have kibbutz kaliyot and gathering the exiles, and the Jews are coming home, and we're building up the country, and you're blessing all the yeshivas and the kolels and the army, that's you, Hashem, returning. We hope we see. We see it, and we're not blind. Meaning, the request is not we hope we're, not that we hope we're alive during the time, that we hope we have the clarity of thought to see your return. Tragically for me, as the years go on, I see how precise this interpretation is. So many of our holy brothers in the year 2018, yes, and what do you think about what's going on? About history? About the prophecies in front of our eyes. So what are you talking about? Tel Aviv. We have a prime minister that has been on filling. There's Chil Shabbos in the country. There's horrible stuff. People in Beit Shemesh are eating treif. And that's all true. Bibi is not putting on film as, there, as far as I know. And in Tel Aviv, not everyone is showing Torah mitzvos. And there's some stuff there that we certainly don't subscribe to. And in Beit Shemesh, there are stores that sell pork. That's true. But what about the full picture? What about the fact we can defend ourselves? What about the fact that Kibbutz Galiot, the people come from all four corners of the globe? Just like Hashem predicted. What about the fact that the Gdolim are here more than anywhere? More yeshivas, more town people learning. Across the world, Jews are assimilating tragically in here. They're marrying other Jews. What about the fact that 93% of the Jews here light Hanukkah candles? Do you see what's going on? Do you see? So, many holy brothers don't. They don't see it. It's so tragic. So tragic. And that's why our request is, our tefillah is, I want to be here during this time, Hashem, of course. I want to see it. And I want to embrace it. And I want to be part of it. And I want to appreciate it. I want to have a kartatov to you, Hashem. That's what it says. And that's what that beautiful, beautiful piece of work is behind me. The Migdash, which we should have the hair of Yemenu speed in our days, with the request from Hashem, that all of us, all of the holy Jewish people, all of our holy brothers, Hashem, please open their eyes so they could see this glorious, glorious moment of Jewish history. And they could live it and breathe it and appreciate the glorious times that we're living in. Shalom.